But when you see the people arrive, it's hard to describe that feeling. It's like you cut your skin and see the blood come out, fresh blood. And you see that one will never heal. And uh, people just mess with those blood, but it, there's no intention to really stop it. The, the whole situation is so desperate because you don't see human connections in those events. It's completely cut it off. Fighting is a symptom of life in every level of life or aspect of a living species. They, they initiate to make some change. It all requires some level of fighting. I don't feel I have a responsibility because I'm an artist. You know, I, this is my profession. I do what I can, and uh, you know I bear the responsibility, and I take the consequence, and uh, you know I don't know where it leads me, but which is okay. What I'm uh, always being involved is about the human rights, about uh, human struggle, and the freedom of speech. Those kind of value is not given by anybody. It's always come through a fighting, a struggle, because somebody has to defend it, you know. And uh, and also, if just one person defend it, it benefit everybody. yesterday which was a very uh, very uh, strong cold I have to stay in bed for quite some time and uh, and I, I can realize that could be the end of the day that will be very peaceful I think uh, we live in the reality we are not living in, in some kind of fantasy about uh, ourselves and we are just uh, a weak um, individual, which I think is quite vulnerable, uh, a species in the uh, still alive, and uh, and also the time is uh, countable. This is never going to be an end. I don't think things are getting any better, and uh, uh, and uh, it doesn't really getting worse because it's already is the bottom. It's not you cannot get much worse unless you directly kill those refugees, and and, <laughs> and otherwise uh, I don't see it, it, it's uh, it's already uh, very bad.